tropical storm Beta in the Gulf and a historic day for hurricane season. Weather Chief Bill Taylor is here and Bill, it's all Greek to us. Yes, yeah, second name on the Greek list already and for the first time since we've been naming Mother Nature's biggest storms back in the 50s, we named three in the same day. In fact, it was over the course of about seven hours that we got Wilfred, then Alpha near Portugal, and here's Beta, about two to 300 miles off the coast and a lot stronger than initially thought. See, the first plane that went out on this, the Air Force Hurricane Hunters, it was struck by lightning on its way out to the Gulf of Mexico. It had to turn around and go back because it fried the circuit board and all its instrumentation. So the plane that finally got out there found that winds are at about 60 miles per hour sustained already. So it's a very strong tropical storm. You can see the amount of convection on this. The center of circulation is back on the lower end, right about here. And so all the convection blowing up on that northeast side. Here's what the computer models are saying. One sends it where Sally made landfall, but the consensus is a left turn over the weekend. This was just updated and you can see it should be nearing hurricane force by tomorrow afternoon and taking that huge left turn and moving west towards the coast. Now the initial landfall forecast brought it in around Matagorda, but this newest one keeps it out at sea, moving it closer to Houston. Aaron.